to invite to another person uh, performed a very uh, significant role in conducting this uh, uh, conference, making this conference successful. Uh, he's a senator, University of uh, Lethbridge, Alberta, Canada. I don't um, announce the name at this stage, but I just give you a surprise that we are a very good person in this conference today. And uh, I mean, Dr. Mashoud Kazi Saab. So Dr. Mashoud Kazi is an executive with over 25 years of experience in technology management, strategic planning, and um, consulting. He has an extensive background working on projects in North America, Middle East, South Asia, and Africa, where uh, he has delivered strategic solutions in a variety of industries, including information technology, public sector, healthcare, and so on, the civil organization. Uh, so, and I would like to invite Dr. Kazi to present his work in today's conference, uh, taking care of time. So, Dr. Mashoud Kazi, sir, Mike, hand over to you. Sir, very merbani, very merbani, and uh, I promise I'll not take uh, more than five minutes because I know the time is precious. Uh, while we are waiting for our next speaker uh, to join us over Zoom, I'll take this uh, opportunity to very quickly talk about entrepreneurship. Because uh, as Azhar Rizvi Saab as well as Dr. Dutiyo Saab has talked about research and entrepreneurship and how important they are in our universities. So I just want to quickly touch base on this uh, aspect and want to talk about importance of uh, business incubation centers in universities. Because I know that we have some universities where we have successful incubation centers established, but there is a greater need to make it a more disciplined approach when we talk about incubation. And the reason why we want to establish these incubation centers is, is to promote the culture of entrepreneurship because this is a culture which is vital tool for the economic development of any country. And nowadays, uh, as we can uh, see that majority of the organization look to support business incubation and entrepreneurship through facilitating universities regarding the development and making of new products and services. And many universities across the globe have technology-based incubators to train their students and provide an environment to develop various types of products and services. Therefore, the such uh, incubation centers encourages the transfer of technologies developed in the universities back to the societies through the creation of new businesses. And that's how we promote the culture of uh, entrepreneurship by using the incubation centers that are being established in the universities. Now, in order to establish an incubation center successfully in a university, I think there is uh, a need for the government of Pakistan, Higher Education Commission, and the universities together with the industry to work in collaboration and come up with a realistic and practical policy so that can promote uh, the culture of incubation in universities in our academic institutions. The HAC has to provide ample funding to universities in order to encourage establishment of these centers, while there will be a very important role of universities to make sure that they will provide the comfortable working space with all the relevant infrastructure or the shared services, you know, internet, yeah, infrastructure, shared resources, yeah, even from uh, the perspective of accounting, legal, HR, the UHA services, universities can uh, provide in the process. Mein. And then a deep engaged leader, mentor for each company whose role will be to help the startups access a large mental network ideally spread across the world as many startups look at addressing global markets. So we don't want, you know, those leaders or those managers managing incubation centers who may probably not have enough knowledge of how to lead and manage uh, uh, these type of projects. So we will need some excellent professionals to help uh, develop these incubation centers and promote uh, the, the concept of uh, incubation by providing new services and products through those centers. 
and then there will be an opportunity for these startups to engage in the with more experienced professionals investors at some point in time as azar sahab rightly said that uh, he was helpful in bringing over 500 million dollar worth of investment through the angel uh, investors network spread all across the group so we can seek assistance and bring some investments right into the universities in order to promote uh, the culture of incubation and then we have to also talk to the potential customers either directly or through uh, some other means to make these startups successful while they are in the university especially in the business to business environment i think that will be very crucial for our universities uh, to take care of and we have to provide educational and learning sessions and these sessions can be peer or expert led and touch upon different elements of building a successful enterprise unusa gado gad there are some critical success factors that i just want to quickly touch base and unajila incubation center ke ekde suthyo tarike sa thayne jala cha asa ke karan khuji to what we Uh, have to do is to clearly define the goals of incubation for right from the beginning agar asa ke pay khabar na hai to what we are trying to achieve we will not go anywhere so we have to clearly define the goal of uh, these incubation centers jake leaders unke lead kar incubations ke unan jo entrepreneurial phenomena jeka hai sa bilkul perfect ho jaye unan ke industry jo extensive experience ho jaye khuji they should be aware of the new technologies and jk related clusters and new technologies have also the artificial intelligence hai machine learning hai data mining hai in the kism ja ya cyber security hai misal ke taur pe to in the kism je hunan ke technical know how ho je to ho ehi kism ja products market mein khani achan jinan products ki hina waqt market ke zarurat hai ऐ जिन कंपनीज के असा सिलेक्ट करियो ता इंक्यूबेशन करण जेला पंजे यूनिवर्सिटीज में उनन जी कैरेस्टेस्टिक के बो वेरी क्लियरली असा के दिसन उप वदो त आया उ असा जे उन कोलैबोरेशन नेटवर्क के जे को आए सो स्ट्रेंथन करे सगंदा या कोन करे सगंदा ऐ तेखा पो डाइवर्सिटी ऑफ फंडिंग सोर्सेस ऑब्वियसली वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड देन वी हैव टू क्रिएट अ कल्चर वेयर वी कैन शेयर एक्सपीरियंसेस विद ईच अदर तो ये न थे तो इंक्यूबेशन सेंटर्स के साइलोस के अंदर कम करना हो जाए, बल्कि ऐसा जो कम यो हो तो तो ऐसा उन्हें जो को एरो नेटवर्क ठाई हो क्लोजली अलाइन्ड, जो को है कभी ऐसा गलाय सगन, है कभी मां सिखी सगन, एंड बेस्ड ऑन द एक्सपीरियंसेस ऑफ ईच अदर, दे कैन ग्रो एंड दे कैन प्रोफेशनली मकसद यो है तो असा के जके असा जे वाइस चांसलर साहब रजिस्ट्रार साहब या एचईसी जे डॉक्टर भवानी शंकर साहब जिन बैठल है इनन के रिक्वेस्ट या हुंदी त दे हैव टू टॉक टू द कंसर्नड अथॉरिटीज एंड दे हैव टू वर्क विद कंसर्नड गवर्नमेंट एजेंसीज सो दैट वी कैन स्ट्रेंथन द कांसेप्ट ऑफ इंक्यूबेशन एंड कांसेप्ट ऑफ इनोवेशन एंड लर्निंग ताकि न सिर्फ असा जे स्टूडेंट सिकली प्रैक्टिकल शे में हथ विजी कम करे सगन बल्कि उन सा गदो गद जने हो मार्केट में वनन त मार्केट में या त पहिजे प्रोडक्ट सा गद वनी सगन ए या मार्केट में बेहतर तरीके सा यूटिलाइज थी सगन दिस इज व्हाट आई वांटेड टू ब्रीफली टॉक हाने